with uh, many concerns going on today, there is also a concern for beef shortages and raised prices in stores. Many meat packing and food processing workers have contracted COVID-19, making their less employees. In the last two months, 22 meat packing plants have closed. These closures have reduced pork and beef slaughter capacity and have caused some supermarkets like Costco to limit the amount of meat consumers can buy. Prices have also gone up, but there might be some good news in all of this. There are many health benefits of eating less red meat, including a lessened risk of certain cancers, diabetes, and heart disease. Speaking of protein, a thousand cases of milk are being given away by the Auburn Rotary Club. The giveaways will be held on May 27th and June 3rd at Casey Elementary School in the Town Center Plaza in Auburn. The giveaways are limited to the, fir- to the first 500 vehicles and will be held from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. That's all for news. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. A man who was reported missing was rescued at the Great Bear Recreation Area off of Route 57 yesterday after he struggled to find his way back out of the woods as nighttime fell. The man, who had been reported to have Parkinson's disease, was rescued after a three-hour-long search by many county officials from Oswego to Fulton. Also, with the help of the Onondaga County Wilderness Research and Rescue Team, accompanied by Onondaga County Sheriff's Air One Flight, The man was safely rescued under no conditions and well. Good morning, everyone, and happy Monday. Today, unfortunately, is going to have some off and on rain showers with a high of 59. But luckily, that is the lowest temperature this week as Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday will have highs in the high high 60s, the low 70s, with straight sunshine all day. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, though, will have some rain off and on with temperatures in the high 70s to potentially 80s. Uh, We'll see about that later on in the week, though. I'm Emily with your weather. Yesterday, a live golf tournament was played for the first time in 66 days. It was a charity skins tournament at the Seminole Golf Course in Florida. The teams were Justin Johnson and Rory McIlroy, versus Ricky Fowler and Matthew Wolf. Each team was playing for a different charity, and in total, several million dollars were raised for COVID-19 related relief. Dustin Johnson and Rory McIlroy won the tournament for their charity, the American Nurses Foundation. This was a great tournament that brought so much good into the world and helped so many people. I'm David with your sports.